Hey guys, it's Dominic here with another tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you some of my favorite and most common grip clamps that I use on set. So, let's get started. So here's the most popular clamp that I use on set, which is the grip clip or A clamp. I use this to attach gels to lights, secure cables to C-stands, and attach reflectors. These come in various sizes. I usually have two to four on my belt buckle for production at all times. Next up are C47s or bullets. These are just wooden clothespins and are very popular for light use situations. Again, for clipping gels to barn doors and tightening clothes on someone to shape them. I don't know why they're called C47, but the legend goes is that producers needed to come up with a flashy name in order to get production to buy them. Here we have a Mathalini clamp. This is functionally similar to a Cardellini clamp. We have a center jaw and end jaw. This clamp is great for attaching lights to speed rail pipe. The rubber on the inside helps to grip the speed rail, ensuring safety. But keep in mind to always use safety clips as a secondary precaution. This style of clamp has a 5-8 spud to help attach lights. Here we have jaw clamps or Mafer clamps. What's unique about this clamp is that it gives you the option to replace the 5 8 screw on spud with any attachment that can fit in this hole below. I use this to attach small cameras in high and tight places. I also use this with a C-stand to attach pipe. And here we have the quacker clamp. It is also called duckbill or platypus. It's essentially a vice grip with a spud for mounting in a C-stand and flat plates to grab onto large flat objects. This clamp is great for attaching beadboard or reflectors to C-stands and is a must-have on set for me. And there you have it, some of my favorite grip clamps. We like to see how you use your grip clamps on set, so please send us links down below in our comment box. We're also available on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Until next time, I'm out. Ah! Mm-hmm. Hey. If you love gear and knowledge as much as we do, then subscribe to our channel by clicking our logo. Here are a couple more videos for your enjoyment.